How does it feel? Everywhere else in the States is like freezing. Yeah. <laughs> Just point the camera up. <laughs> this is our version of winter. California, 2014. LOL. Sorry, the rest of the country. <laughs> Sky. Yeah, you can record.
Shingo and uh, this was Saturday day three of the big event and um, once again it's overwhelming inside on the floor with all the different booths offering all this amazing equipment but luckily I was there in time to get word that there might have been an invisible scratch pickles reunion with Shortcut, Qbert and Mike however it didn't transpire due to certain sort of difficulties or issues with uh, companies and different different companies being sponsors for it. But it was still amazing. Cuber did a great performance. Shortcut did a great solo performance. A little reminiscent of the set that he had done at the Boiler Room in San Francisco uh, last week. Mixmaster Mike was there. He didn't get to perform, and people were joking, saying this was since they thought it was going to be invisible scratch pickles, and only Cuba was there, and you couldn't see the other two. That it truly was invisible scratch pickles performance. And um, there was a lot of great people there too, like all of the beat junkies. Nearly everybody was there. Uh, Maceo from uh, De La Soul was there, and uh, Keith Shockley was there, and just a bunch of different people. And these kids, Monster DJ, young kid, he's only 11 years of age, only DJing for four months. Wowed all of these veteran DJs of like 20 plus years. So it was good. It was a good uh, event today. Yeah, good camaraderie. Yeah, really good camaraderie. It definitely sort of made you feel good just to be there and a part of it. That everybody's doing it for the love. Love of traffic. Huh? Love of traffic. Love of traffic. Just to get down here. Yeah. Yeah. No. A lot. <laughs> a lot of traffic. Exactly. It's crazy. I've never been to the NAM convention before and it's overwhelming there's so much going on but it really is a lot of fun and you kind of want to buy every instrument they have every mixer every little bit of equipment 